But would you like braids on? I can do it for you upstairs, $100. Uh, no, I don't want my hair braided. I mean, doesn't it look like I was on my way somewhere? I mean, it's obvious. I was in transit with some place to go and my hair is laid. So why on earth would you ask me if I want to get my hair braided right now? I mean, I can understand if I were just like casually walking around in the neighborhood, right? And maybe if I were a tourist and I'm like looking up at the buildings, taking in the sights. Okay, that would make sense. Now that I can understand because okay. that's actually your target market. Never mind. No, look, you got this whole tour bus here. Maybe wait and see who comes off and maybe they want to get their hair braided. You should be looking for tourists, right? Or um, maybe some young people who are just kind of hanging out in the neighborhood. I mean, maybe they have, you know, make sure they have money, right? That they look like they have money. Um, or what about a mom with a young little girl whose it's hair okay. is a mess? Because, you know, braids okay. would actually help thank her you. because then she wouldn't thank have to you. keep fixing the child's thank hair. Thank you, thank you, I, I'm thank just you. trying to help her. I thought you had someone to do. I can wait. All right, so let's, okay. See? Oh, right there. And she was looking over at you. Hmm. Look, it's obvious that she doesn't live here, right? She's visiting Harlem. Maybe she would want to get her hair braided for the experience of it all. And you didn't even say anything. You let her walk right by. And look, and, and here's another woman. Look, she's just kind of like hanging out in Harlem. Look, taking pictures. She would totally want to get her hair braided and go back to wherever she's from and be like, oh yeah, I got my hair braided in Harlem. Why don't you ask her? And she keeps looking back at you. She just looks back. Not as just. Look, I'm just, listen. I have a degree in marketing. Okay, I just I know these things. I'm just saying. I'm just trying to help you. Here. I did not ask for your help. I asked if you wanted your hair braided. You are very rude. Rude. You stopped me, and I just stood here for how long, giving you, you tips? You think you know so much? My family depends on me to provide for them. This is not the Harlem you used to know. Many of my customers can't even afford to live here. But what am I to do? This is what I know. I support my family here and in Nigeria. I won't even go to details of how painful it is to stand for hours on end in my wrist from braiding so fast to get as many customers as possible. You have no idea. You are very spoiled and you are very rude. Hey, who's black on I'm sorry. Look, I just got laid off, okay? And I worked my butt off at that job. I've been looking for work and I haven't had any luck. I was, I was going to the library just because I need to get out of my apartment or else I'm gonna go crazy. Look, I'm frustrated, okay? And I'm angry and I'm sorry. I shouldn't have taken it out on you. Yes, yes, I would like for you to braid my hair. I'm Barbara, what's your name? I can braid hey. your hair. Hey, hey. hey. I, 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 I will deal with you. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Ade, my name is Ade. Miss, what do you pay? Well, you said 100. I usually charge 150. <sighs> it's okay, it's okay. Come upstairs. Oh my God, really? 